Hey guys, welcome back. So, I've been missing for a little while. Life has just been hitting me like a ton of bricks. You have to be nice and you have to... Be nice and you have to it's like, I can't be all those things at once. I'm a human being. I don't mean to be ranting and raving like this. I don't, don't use this footage, please. It's just gonna make me look stupid. But I'm back. Today is Friday and it's not just any Friday, it's affordable Friday. I went out to Ulta and I picked up something cute. All right, let's get into the video. I picked up the pumpkin hydra and peeling duo pads so this comes with an essence pad and a peeling pad and i picked up the pumpkin hydra peeling duo pad from too cool for school this is a korean brand it has glycerin it has niacinamide it has evening primrose oil salicylic acid it also has pumpkin ferment extract at 100 parts per million so let's just see what these do so I'm gonna wash my face with my regular skincare stuff and I'm kind of just gonna use the nighttime peeling pad as my toner and then I'm gonna follow up with like my normal skincare ingredients and I'm just gonna use the peeling pad on its own and just put on a moisturizer and that's all um, so I can kind of gauge the effects of how the peeling pad works at nighttime and then when I wake up in the morning I'm going to use the essence pad because one is for nighttime one is for daytime I'm gonna use the essence pad in the morning and just give you feedback on how I feel about that with my SPF So this cleanser actually smells like my friend I gave one to my friend and one of my friends said it smells like ramen noodles. Ooh. Um, but to me it kind of smells like bread yeast. If you're used to that like smell, um, the longer you leave it on the deeper it cleans. But I just leave it on for a little bit. I just rinse it off. Alright. So I'm gonna go rinse this off and I will be right back. Great. So my face is clean. <sighs> you can even see the difference. Wow. This does have a fragrance, by the way, um, but it's the last ingredient on the list. So you know that it's not going to be super potent and it's not like heavily concentrated. Mm. It actually smells like, really, really good. Wow. Okay, so this is the pad. It's really tiny and just kind of pops out like that. So I'm just gonna, and it actually tapes right back like pretty good. So I like that. All right. Oh, so I don't feel any like ting tingling or like, you know, stinging sensations. Like it's, it doesn't feel like an acid, so the salicylic is not that heavily concentrated. And this like pad isn't like soaked in like the essence, so my face isn't like completely wet as I would like it to be. So what I'm actually gonna do is use another one. I don't know if I should do that, but I'm going to anyway because this is like dry already. So the fragrance is really light. So far, when it comes to like the exfoliation effect, it's definitely getting like some dead skin because I can see some coloration like on the pad, which you can see. I don't think you can see it, but there is some dirt on here. Um, definitely good at exfoliating. My skin does feel hydrated from the pad because of the hyaluronic acid. So I'm not gonna put anything else on my face. I'm actually just gonna go to bed like this so that when I wake up in the morning, I can actually see the results for itself rather than like me putting something else over it to kind of combat like the skin issues that I'm facing right now. So what I'm gonna do, like I said, is just go straight to bed like this, no moisturizer. I'm just gonna rely on the hyaluronic acid and the olive oil extract that's inside of here to kind of, you know, keep my skin maintained. 
and then in the morning I'm just gonna go on with the essence pad side and give you my feedback on that I know I said I was gonna go in with the moisturizer earlier but I'm actually not because that's not really a fair review if I'm using another product with this um, so I will see you guys in the morning I'm going to go to bed all right so I'm back it's morning and I can see that my skin looks a lot oh my god the train man I can see that my skin looks a lot clearer um, in terms of like how yeah like the pad did a really great job my skin feels soft um, and smooth I'm gonna put like a side by side so you can see like the difference between last night and today and now I'm gonna get in the shower because I have to be to work in like 45 minutes so I'm back and now I'm just getting ready for work well I actually need to leave now but I'm gonna get started with the essence pad part and I'm just gonna test this out throughout the day and see how my skin reacts to it and just how it feels hmm that's interesting so this side actually has more essence and it's more hydrating than the other pad from last night I only I took out two pads but I only need to use one I feel like and it's like the same like scrubbing texture pad well I already took it out so I might as well use it definitely one of my first thoughts is I love the essence pad it's very very hydrating the scent is the same but not as intense as the nighttime one I'm guessing it's like the nighttime one is like to help you like you know go to bed it's like some kind of sandalwoody scent so it's really soothing and relaxing so now I'm just gonna head out to work and I'm gonna check back in with you guys later and give you my final thoughts we're sorry the number you have dialed is not in service at this time the time now is 8 15 I left today at around I want to say nine o'clock this morning so my final thoughts on <laughs> The pumpkin hydro peeling duo pads looking for like a chemical exfoliant definitely go out and grab these um i think they're amazing they come with 50 pads on each side so you definitely should have enough um it should last you well over a month um and just keep in mind that this is an aha so you don't want to use this every day so i would probably recommend just using it about four times a week so maybe monday tuesday and then like friday saturday and obviously like alternating between the days but also make sure that you're using an SPF over 30 um, because again this does have salicylic acid so remember when you go out into the Sun without moisturizer or SPF on it kind of just like ages you definitely do recommend this if you're interested go pick it up I got this from Ulta and you can also find it on the Soko Glam website thank you again for watching and I'll see you in the next one bye hey, they know that women go nut by, uh, about 10 inches well, first of all, I ain't finna nut by no 10 inch because ain't no 10 inch finna touch me. They know they're gonna drive them crazy, and if they get with them and they come back to the worship service, and they, next time they have worship service, that, that, that woman gonna be at the altar. That's gonna be up there, and she, he knows what she up there for. And uh, he gonna get scared.